Welcome back guys, today I'll show you how to repair a LCD screen on a Prius Generation 2 2008. First thing you want to do is take the white cover off the back. We're going to take off the three screws that hold the screen into place. And now we're going to disconnect the ribbon connectors that are connected to the screen. Just pull down the tabs on each side and the wire just pulls out. So make sure it's disconnected and then we can move on to the next one. And we're going to do the same thing here. Just pull down the tabs carefully. Don't yank them. Just be really gentle. Once both of them are off, the screen should just lift up. We've already repaired this LCD before. The problem it had was the capacitor was gone. This is a really common issue with the Generation 2 Priuses. The one where the pen is pointing is the replacement capacitor. The original one looks like this silver one on the side. To take out the original one, you can hold it with a pair of pliers and just twist it and wiggle it out of position and it just pulls out. The original capacitor comes with 100 UF and 16 volts. You can replace it with the same size of 100 UF and 16 volts or you can put a 220 UF with 16 volts. In this one we've used the 220 UF capacitor. This is because these ones are more reliable than the 100 UF and it will last much longer. To connect the new one you need to make sure that you connect the positive and the negative connections in the right place. We're going to stabilize the screen by putting the screws back in. This will make it easier to put the ribbon connectors back into the ports. And pull it back and carefully slide it into the slot. Once it's fully in, just press up the tabs so that it locks into position. We're going to do the same for the bigger connector as well.
And once that's done, you can start putting the screws back in. So the top right screw, one on the bottom left, and one in on the top and bottom of the center. You can put the speedometer back onto the dashboard and it will be ready to fit back into the bar. Make sure to like the video, leave a comment if you have any suggestions and subscribe to our channel and make sure you click the bell icon to get regular notifications of our new uploads. Thank you.